All right, guys. I was trying to get the FedEx man record and dropping this thing off today. Um, and I normally don't record an unboxing, but uh, as y'all can see, you uh, we got damage on the box. So I'm gonna take my time and get this thing out. And I'm sure most of y'all already know what's in this box. It is the brand new blackjack. No, I'm sorry. Blackjack. I'm sorry. I already got the blackjack, y'all. I've been sitting out here for a freaking hour and a half waiting on the FedEx man. It is the new and improved Impulse Toe Rework 32. Just bad to the phone with smart technology, y'all. 180 speed control basically you're looking at what everybody's wanting to do to the sonic weight but just better because it's fiberglass and it's just bad to the bone y'all i mean i feel like a kid on christmas day i got an email saying this thing was coming Didn't think it was coming out yet. We've been waiting on a super fast boat. Oh my God, look at this beautiful thing, y'all. Let Nate back up a little bit on the recording here. Sorry, y'all, Nate's, Nate's new at this. He gets excited like I do looking at it. This should have the uh, the same remote as the uh, the Blackjack 42. We'll check it out. Should have the yep DX3. Got your batteries in here. This is what we want to see though. Let's get this thing out of here. I can't wait to take it out on the water, y'all. We got bad weather coming. Don't know if we're gonna get to run it yet or not, but we're gonna we're gonna try. I got batteries charged up and everything for this thing, so it's ready whenever we get a chance to get on down there to the but our dock is really, really messed up with hydro right now. So, uh, it's going to be one of those where we're going to have to probably take it to the river, which I like better anyway. Yeah, well packaged, don't see any damage. Got some damage to my box, but nothing on the boat. Man, this thing is so, I mean, just look at it, guys. Y'all, it, it's beautiful. The water pickup's in the bottom. Right at the bottom, plus you got a pickup for the on the rudder. And check out that rudder. Already sharpened, angled. It's very nice, very nice. Let's get this box out of the way and see if we can. Look. Look down here, guys. Another buddy Petey. He, he's been out here waiting with me. Yeah, he's he's excited as I am, I think. I, he's checking it out, no doubt. He don't know what's going on either. Another boat to add to the marina we got going on in there. <laughs> He's probably real excited. But check out the exhaust ports on the sides, right at the back. Water coming right out the back so you can tell when you're uh, you're getting your cooling. There's no doubt in it. You'll be just able to see it spraying. Get this thing opened up slowly. I don't even want to set it down. Thick, I can tell you guys right now because um, it's actually uh, yeah, this thing's as thick as my Miskaka. That's it's lives. not a cat, so it looks way smaller. This thing what? is Bruh. it's freaking this, what the? it's just what you would expect what the? from Horizon, guys. It is absolutely an incredible boat. I can't wait to get this thing out of the water. 
like it's got a very nice boat stand and all to it. It looks like the same one on the Skyco. Uh, I don't know. I really got to wedge it in there. Take your time getting it out of there, guys, because it's nice. All right, I'm going to set this thing over here for a second, put this boat stand together real quick. Bear with me, guys, my videographer just left. Yeah. A nice wooden stand that comes the old one everybody liked way better the quality is definitely coming back up again these cuts are perfect you can hear them going together guys it's actually well made and uh, looks like it's gonna be a nice boot stand get it together right quick Well, well, dialed cut. Sorry, guys. I know I'm everywhere with this video right this second. There we go. Like I said, this thing's put together. So. Sorry guys, I'm fumbling, but hey, I'm excited. Now, now we can see the beauty in this thing. Deep, deep battery compartments. This thing is a lot like the Sonic Wave, guys. Just sleek, look at the back end of this thing. Very, very nice. The strut is very long. Like the it's almost like the Muskaiko strut back here. It sits way back, back behind. You can see how far they kind of staggered it back behind everything. It's probably sitting about four to seven millimeters maybe behind the rudder. Uh, really strong. Looks like everything is just huge. Nice strong collar. Super thick wires on this thing. Uh, it's very nice made. Waterproof receiver box. And I'm telling you guys, I love this freaking. I, I, I've got a brand new one in the box. I've just got the connectors. I'm, I've got a six pole dynamite, 2000 dynamite. I'm about to redo my sonic wake and wake that thing up too, guys. So, uh, just a heads up that hey, sometimes you just can't leave things alone and I'm one of those guys I just can't leave them alone this thing is absolutely beautiful look at the lines on that boat. absolutely beautiful I can't wait to get this thing out and run it I'm about to go get my batteries, guys. I will be back soon.